Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome to This and That Plays. I'm Antoine, and I am playing Tales of Arise. That's right, another Tales of game that just came out. Uh, I haven't played one since back in the day, actually. It's been a while. So, definitely looking forward to it. Hope you guys enjoy. And if you do, hit that like button and remember to subscribe so that way you can come back for some future videos of things that me and Sky post. And yeah, with that being said, let's hop into it. In ages long past, it was believed that Mother Dana was indestructible and everlasting. Rena, on the other hand, was thought to be the domain of the gods, a paradise where the souls of the departed could rest forevermore. Good view. Oh, how wrong we were. In the face of Rena's unimaginable technology, its soldiers, clad in huge, shining armor, and its fearsome beasts, known as Zoogles. The prosperity and bounty of Dana all but disappeared overnight. That was 300 years ago. Damn. The world of Dana fell under Renin rule and its new masters split the land into five distinct realms. And now today, Orbis Calaglia, one of the Renin's five realms. It is ruled over by the tyrant Balsef, Lord of the Firemaster Corps. Unrelenting fire scorches this barren wasteland. Dust storms course over the rocks and crags, and no relief is to be found from the oppressive heat. The Danon people toil as slaves. Day after day they suffer, under the ruthless oppression of the Renin soldiers, with only one hope of escape. Death. Only in death is their agony finally brought to an end. They have forgotten what it means to be free. So complete is the Renin's domination. Bills of her eyes. Jesus Christ, guy, that thing's like 50 times that kid. Come on now. You call that punching? Put some back into it, embedded. You should really push with your back, too. Uh, Iron Mask? Why you? Let me. Huh. What is this? Some kind of slave support group? Mind your own business, you worthless! All right, third squad! Time to regroup! <laughs> go on, get moving! Hey, you better go regroup, buddy. Hey, wait for me! Thank you, Iron Mask. It's okay, Cole. Are you hurt? No, I'm fine. Iron Mask, you... you're bleeding. Hmm? We need to get you looked at by Doc. That bad, huh? Better safe than sorry, I suppose. Ask Doc to treat you. <sighs> I doubt Doc's gonna like what he sees. Of course not, he's a doctor. They never like what they see.
Ah, you again. It is I. Sorry to trouble you, Doc. Hmm. Look after yourself, and there'd be no need for sorries, would there? Now sit. So, still unable to remember anything, I take it? Blank as always. Nothing but that strange dream. No face, no memories. Unable to feel pain, yet only too eager to take on everybody else's. What will we do with you? Here, let me see. You may not be able to feel pain, but that doesn't mean you can't be wounded, just like everyone else. Mm -hmm. If you're not more careful, okay. you'll wind up dead without even realizing it one of these days. Yeah, pain is a very I valuable tool. another slave die today. More corpses than I care to count. Unfortunately, that's hardly a rare sight around these parts. Danons are always dying, and the Renans just watch. How long can this continue? Why doesn't anyone stand and fight? Keep your voice down, will you? <sighs> if only it were so simple, my friend. There have certainly been uprisings, all right. Three centuries worth of the damn things. As for all the good they've done, take a look around and judge for yourself. <sighs> there. That should just about do it. Now, do me a favor and try to stay out of trouble so the wound doesn't open again. Doc, back when I knew nothing, you were the one who taught me just how things work around here. You know I'll always be grateful for that. But I can't just... The race is won by the calm and the steady. You're still young, and you have time. Wait for the right moment, both for yourself and the world. Work will be wrapping up for the day soon enough. Don't sit around here. Go out and feel the breeze against your skin. Even a slave's entitled to that. Just do me a favor and keep a low profile, all right? You stand out enough in that mask as it is. Guess I'll go back to my room. Let's go back to the room. I'm a slave, just like everyone else here. So oh, how come shit. I don't have a spirit core? Yo, face or memories for that matter. Yo, homie, you good? They're not moving. Damn it! No, no, you are not the Don't worry about it. It'll change anything. Damn, dude! Holy shit! This game's fucking brutal. Something tells me I should explore, but then something also tells me that it won't do me any I good right now. <laughs> I wonder how many people have slept in this bed before me. Mine for now, but for how long? Tomorrow's another day. I guess I should get some shut eye. I'd better head to work. Time to go to work. So I've got business with the freight train today, huh? Great. What is that? What is that? What is that? There's something, something green over here. Is that you? That is you. What do you want? Hurry and get going. You're on freight hauling duty today. Okay. All right. I'm on the way. Great. Let's see. Time to start another day toiling away for the Renans. Am I gonna do this until the day I die? Till the day you die, or until the day we break free? crush our enemies and we free all the people look lively slaves let's see some work around here Dude, imagine one of those freaking things. Oh, shit. Boom. 
I ain't gonna lie, you kind of deserve it. You guys are assholes. <laughs> Oh, you guys almost killed her in that freaking explosion. Do you ever think of that? It's a good ass shovel, man. You should take that with you. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> Damn. That's what you get for helping people. <laughs> She's dead too. <laughs> That's a little high. Ain't no surviving that. The girl's nowhere to be found. Yeah, this hurts. Hey, Impenage, did you find anything? Not yet, sir. What do they expect from us on such short notice? <laughs> Hey, you're... <laughs> and there it was. Love at first sight. <laughs> Over there! Don't move! Go now! Huh? Hurry, get moving! <clears throat> Stay still! You cost us a lot of trouble, you know. Now we can do this the easy way, or not. Just go, go, go give them the thunder slap of death. <laughs> Can't touch this. Ah, oh, damn, he's agile. Matrix, bitches. <laughs> Do that. You don't want to do that. That's gonna hurt. That's bad. <laughs> Where you go? Hope you can jump. Huh? That was a pretty damn big explosion. <laughs> your chance to become lord which means you lot live and die for me the mighty balsav got that through your skulls now hurry up and bring me shion mighty <laughs> balsav <sighs> and look he's got a little doggy Even dish drinks lost its appeal. <laughs> someone's in a bad mood 
Lord That's a little bull or something. Ruler of Orbis Calaglia. Ah, but it's wild beast you prefer, isn't it? Do forgive me. Ganabelt Volkiris. What do you want? From what I hear, you seem to be having some trouble over there in Calaglia. As a fellow lord, I merely thought to ask whether I could be of any assistance to you. Enough with the false pretense. I can tell a rat when it's sniffing around. Forgive me, I can only imagine the emotional toll failing to ascend the throne not once but twice must take. Damn. A most distressing <laughs> state of affairs. Shut up! It's none of Just gotta rub it in there a little bit. <laughs> the crown contest is proceeding apace, and so quickly, I must say. It won't be long before the victor is crowned as the new sovereign. I look forward to it, and you can be sure I won't forget our little chat. Nor will I. Until next time. It's a big ass doggy dish. <laughs> No need to break it, guy. Come on. No class. No class. What the hell's wrong with you? Epic flashback. Or I'm just waking up. One of the two. Oh, is that the... Yeah, he, he mentioned he was having a dream of some sort, so that must be what it is. He just can't see it clearly enough to know what's going on. You awake? Who are you? The name's Tilsa. I'm the medical officer for the Crimson Crows. You're in one of our safe houses. Crimson Crows? Don't tell me you've never heard of us. We're the resistance for the Danon people. We get in the way of the Bright Eyes' best laid plans. The Danon resistance? I didn't know such a thing existed. Oh, we exist all right. Though I guess we're not as famous as I thought we were. Seems like I know more about you than the other way around, Mr. Iron Mask. Is it true you can't take that thing off? Yeah. Worse is that I don't even know why I'm wearing it. That woman I was with. Oh, yeah. She's quite the character, isn't she? Zephyr should be interrogating her over in the slammer as we speak. You locked her up? Why? Why? Go take a look for yourself if you're so interested. They're interrogating her? Just what the hell is going on? She's electrifying people. They need to ask questions. I All right, that's not normal. Find out for myself. <laughs> this is like a freaking human Pikachu. Anyways, I'm gonna end it there. So thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, remember. Hit the like, subscribe, come back for some more stuff, and stay awesome, everybody. I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace.